uh, something I bought at the Asian market. And so it's just a little hand sieve. And now the thing about this is you've got the big uh, pods and you can, we can pick those out and kind of squish them to break the seed out. But you've also got a whole bunch of little weird stuff in the bottom. So let's take this. You just shake it around. You see all the uh, all the dust and all those those are the dead seed and debris left after the aphids ate most of them. But you can see there's a lot of good seed in here, and this is not hard. To, the pod is not hard to pick up. So there's your there's your kale seed, and I'm just going to take that. Just take that good seed, just let it sit and dry out for a week or so, and then you can package it up, put a label on it, where you got it, that's the provenance, and the date, so that when you're sitting there with a shoebox full of seeds a year from now trying to figure out what's what, you know what you're looking at, and, um, and that is a lot of kale seed. You think that each one of those little seeds will make a big fat plant, you can get several cuttings off each one. And so if you lose some, if the birds get it, it doesn't matter. You grew it yourself. It's used to your yard. And you didn't pay $2.50 a package for it either. And you'll get lots. Plenty.